Hey, Wheezy Mondayers. This video is visually interesting. And audio audioly interesting as well. I, get, I know the word is auditorially, but, or auditor, yeah, is that the word? Auditorily? But, you get what I mean. So, <laughs> I guess I picked the wrong time to start this video. What do you mean? So, um, I picked the perfect time, you're right. So what is this, day day four of uh, back, back to back to uh, the non-vegan month? Back to back to regular life? Uh, I actually thought I would last a little longer, but because we're traveling, because we're back in Austin and I want to eat the old foods that I love, I did get right back to non-vegan food pretty quickly. Kind of ashamed of it. I think part of it was the traveling, it was so much more convenient while like towards the end of our travels uh, to just to just go with what was available instead of making every meal be like a little bit more challenging you know um, and I'm not feeling any different really from like going from vegan back to meat and dairy I'm not eating I'm uh, my breakfast is still the same I'm, I've been eating oatmeal and fruit uh, and and with soy milk and it's still the same but the rest of the day it's yeah there's some meat in there I'm de I feel hungrier uh, going back to meat and, meat and dairy when I was on vegetables it was just filling up with vegetables and I was just not hungry a lot of the time now I'll have a big meal with meat and I will still want more food sometimes so that's a benefit I think of of cutting out meat is like I think if you're looking to lose weight, it's a it's a really good way to feel full. Um, you just got to make sure you're getting the right nutrients. Uh, and I feel pretty much the same. I think overall, I probably will eat better because of the vegan month. I don't think it's going to be super extremely life changing, but I think it, I, I will improve my eating. I think I will cook more. Hopefully, uh, I cooked a little bit more than I normally do during the month. And I think, and I just know more about food because of it. And I have a couple interviews to do while in Austin and a video to edit. I'm going to be editing the video probably throughout the month. It's probably going to be a lot, a lot of editing and, and writing and then shooting the, uh, the hosting segments of it. Um, it's going to be quite a bit. What are you doing? Jeez. <laughs> what you doing? What you doing? Um, and but I think it's going to be a really good one. I'm going to try to make sure to like I want to touch upon everything. I want to touch upon a lot of people go vegan because you know they don't want animals to die for their food, and people go and people care about the environment. People care about their health, and I'm going to touch upon all those things. Why they might be good. Why 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 they might some some things might not you know. I'm just going to go into the details and try to figure out what's true, what isn't. And, yeah, oh, is that water bottle in your way? All right, there you go. Yeah. And, oh, okay. I think I might need to wrap this up now. Uh, I uh, been, I started doing Always Wheezies again, though. I just want to let you know. Uh, the, 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 the phone videos, which is, this is a phone video because we're on the road. I move quickly, putting up the ladder. Oh, she didn't finish the song just playing with a fire truck it's really adorable uh but i'm doing some always wheezy videos which is just random phone videos whenever i feel like it on the channel always wheezy which i've i used to do a lot but i i'm, I'm getting back into it right now for no reason i'm gonna put that on the screen i do daily vlogs still on patreon secret daily vlog just for patrons that's on the screen and uh, in case you haven't seen my how-to youtube video that's on the screen there might be something else on the screen i don't know my face is on the screen China, you want to say anything? Nope. Bye.